We have some unfortunate news this morning, and we understand that uh, Yvonne Wamalwa, who is uh, the wife of the late Kijana Wamalwa, has uh, passed on. We've just gotten this news right now. Some breaking news, unfortunate news coming through that Yvonne Wamalwa is uh, dead, and that has been confirmed by her family. And we understand that this happened, though we do not know what exactly happened. Um, hopefully, we'll be able to get the information, more information about her demise here on KTA News. But unfortunate news coming to us that Yvonne. Uh, Wamalwa has passed away. And uh, of course, uh, if you remember, Yvonne Wamala came to the limelight uh, after the passing of uh, the late uh, Kijana Wamalwa. And that's the time that the country got to know uh, much about her uh, back in 2003. And uh, she was uh, his wife. And um, a really unfortunate news coming through that has been confirmed by her family and will be getting the latest uh, information uh, for you here on KTN News. Uh, remember that after the death of uh, her husband, she was appointed as the Deputy Permanent Representative of Kenya to the United Nations Habitat Offices here in Nairobi. She held quite a number of uh, diplomatic positions. That one was one of them as the uh, Deputy Permanent Representative of Kenya to the United Nations Habitat Offices here in Nairobi. Ruby. And after three years, she was appointed as the Deputy High Commissioner of Kenya to Australia. That is also another uh, position that uh, she held. We know for a fact that Yvonne and the late Kijana Omalwa had uh, children. One was, was Michelle Chichi, who was very young, if you remember, at the time that Omalwa passed away. And that was the youngest child, Michelle Chichi. And the eldest, Derek Mboya, um, is also also a, a son to uh, the late uh, Yvonne Wamalwa right now and uh, Kijano Wamalwa. All right, so we'll be getting the latest details of this unfortunate um, event, or, uh, we, but, and we'll be able to give you the latest information with regard to just what happened. Um, but of course, we condole with the family of Yvonne Wamalwa.